quick giveaway before we start this video. I announced my new merch that I just dropped in my last video. Um, if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's on my website, link in the description. Um, I got new buffs, new t-shirts, and actually restocked on some old t-shirts that I uh, ran out of sizes from the last merch drop. But anyways, like I was saying, we got a giveaway. And the giveaway for this is simple. First off, you're gonna need the knowledge from this video to answer a question on a random video on my channel. I won't tell you exactly which one, um, but I'll pin a comment the first words in the comment will say like Black Friday giveaway in big letters. You can't miss it once you find it. Um, and I'll have a question on that video about this video. Answer that question. I'll pick a random comment in about a week and you'll get your free t-shirt, size and color of your choice, um, and a free buff and a few shirts as well. So thank you guys for watching. Good luck to all you guys in entering the giveaway. And let's get on with the video. Oh, oh man. It's on there. Oh, that feels like a good one. First cast. Messed up my reel. <laughs> the beauty of fishing ultralight gear in the surf. But I got him. I don't know how big it is. It's hard to tell with this. Oh, not bad. It's a nice little fish right there. I think I'll let him go. I might keep a few today, but I'll let this first one go. There he is. Little server, he's got a scar right there. Probably got hit by a, a bird or maybe a bigger fish. Both sides right there. But that's a good start right there. First, literally first cast. We'll get him back. All right guys, as you can see, back to the beach today. Today I brought a different rod. Not my normal surf fishing setup. This super tiny ultralight setup. The seven foot ultralight with a 1500 size reel. One of the smallest setups that I own. It's normally my trout setup, but I'm gonna put it to work out here in the surf today. As you can see, you definitely catch fish with it. And the fish you catch are gonna really put it to the test. We got 15 pound braid, 10 pound leader here with a little, I think that's like a quarter ounce maybe, Carolina setup with my sand crab, of course. Oh, there's a bite. Got him. Another good one. All of them feel good with this setup, to be honest. There we go. Another decent one, a little bit smaller than last. We'll get this one back really quick. Get off there. All right, get back in there. There we go. That feels like a good one. Look at that. Ooh, look at that go. Okay. Okay. There we go. Oh yeah, that's a good one. All right, there's our first decent fish of the day. Actually, this one, I think he's been caught before. He's got a little little mark right there on the mouth. I don't know if you can see it. So it's not often you find them like this in the surf. Usually they haven't been, they very rarely do you see one that's been caught before. So this one got away once, but I'm gonna keep him. So he's not getting away the second time. Unhook him, take care of him. If you watched my last video, I talked about what I do to prepare them and take care of them before I pack them up and put them in the freezer or give them away to friends. So if you're interested in that, check that out. It's my last video. I'll leave it linked in the description. But there's fish number one, or I should say, that's actually fish number three, but keeper number one. Let's see if we can find a bigger one now. Oh, oh. 
Oh, oh yeah, he's on. Feels like a good one. That one just destroyed it. Took it and ran. Oh, a little one. Little one, but this one hit it the hardest out of all of them. Oh, next cast, next cast. There we go, another one. Stacked right here. The cool thing about the ultralight is yeah, it's not gonna work all the time, but when it does, you can really, really feel every little tick. Even these little guys. I can feel each little peck, even the little small ones. Here, let's see, watch this. Put another one on. I have another sand crab in here. Oh yeah, there's one. All right, no cuts. Gonna put one on, toss it out. Watch this, they'll hit it within 10 seconds. Oh, there we go. Okay, maybe not 10 seconds, but... Oh, it came off, dang it. Well, that was a little more than 10 seconds. Maybe more like 30 seconds, but still, they're hitting right now. Let's get back in there. So the nice thing about this Carolina setup is it's super natural presentation. I mean, the. The weight sits out there and then the, the bait is just kind of flowing back and forth with the with the swell and the tide. That's perfect. Oh, there's a bite. There it is. Got him. Ooh, there he is right in the right in close there. Another nice little guy. Not huge, but another fish. You probably can't tell because it's super foggy, but the sun is setting. And uh, this is the prime time right now. Uh, let me try to get one more fish. Then we'll call it, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Get a bite. Just sit down here. We'll get one while we're sitting. Oh, oh. last cast now. Alright, this 
That's it. We may have to do this one. We gotta get him here. Shoot. Guess we can't sit him in go in. Running out of light here. All right, this is official for real this time. Definitely the last cast. Probably barely 